Hey guys, yes I am back with episode 13 of the Frenzy Let's Play Well yesterday we were, you know, we kept invading the UK And as you can see, well we captured all of Scotland and basically the entirety of the country So um, we basically won, I mean, well, I said the same thing yesterday, but you know Yeah, it's a win I will just uh, take care of the rest of this, it's really not that much I guess I will send some extra units over here Hopefully they don't get sunk, so I'm gonna go from this side, I guess And uh, after that, well, Ireland is at war with us, so we will land over here In uh, like near Belfast, I'm gonna keep this here since this is still Well, it could revolt, it's still low morale And uh, yeah, what we're really gonna be doing today is um, Preparing to invade Iberia, aka Spain and Portugal and uh, well, Slovakia declared war on me, but it looks like it didn't end very well for them. It looks like I bombed the living uh, souls out of them, as you can see with my four SP artillery I had here. They had like 15 uh, units here, I believe. So they tried to attack me, as you can see, this is a bit lower health, but they failed miserably. So they basically have like no units now. Let's look at those casualties, though. That's gonna be pretty interesting to see. I think they're uh, pretty good. We probably are. So here we go. 6,000 to 7, almost 17,000, so that's not bad at all. I mean, our current KD ratio is 2.91. I wish it was a bit higher, like, I don't know, maybe a 4, but uh, that's all, that's pretty damn good, though. So, yeah, uh, we're gonna just uh, capture these two provinces. We're gonna walk in here, too. I don't think they should have much here at all, so let's just do this. And, uh, well, we're gonna take this, too, and boom, there we go. Basically, we won, so, yeah. We're gonna occupy the country, that's gonna be another 10% boost of morale since we take their capital. Our morale is pretty damn good though, don't get me wrong, like, uh, let's see, this is it. Like, that's uh, some pretty damn good morale, at least in most of the country. And, uh, you know, I've been doing a lot of conquering all the time and I captured Germany not long ago and look at that morale, you know. That's really good, so yeah. Anyway. Uh, so we're also gonna prepare for Romania and uh, Yugoslavia to, to attack, I mean we're all basically already already, you know, but uh, we're gonna get some extra troops here, I guess we could get some here, let's send that there, you know, we're gonna need some reinforcements for that, and perhaps some over here, so uh, let's, let's plan with that too, so let's take like, I don't know, two of these, four of these, put some over here, right on the border there we go we got one like a tank or two to reinforce this uh, we are sort of lacking them it seems let's take these two uh, put them there there we go and uh, maybe some beautiful motorized we have plenty right now actually it seems so that's great so there we go beautiful and uh, like these three can go here too so yeah anyway i guess we could put uh, even more now denmark this should be secure i'm gonna put some extra uh, units extra motorized on the Danzig border so we can actually uh, have that more secured So we'll be more ready when they declare war. I mean we're gonna win anyway, but yeah Let's take these two to bomb Danzig too when they do declare war So we don't take so many casualties, you know, it's just common sense really Gotta take the rest and they're gonna put it on like I don't know the Romanian border I guess so yeah There we go and after I take uh, Bratislava, we'll go over here to Trnava. So there we go, and boom, right there for the Romanian border, which they might declare war any day now, maybe tomorrow. I guess we're gonna see. Let's get level 5 motorized as well as... Um, I'd go for level 5 SP artillery, but honestly that's pretty expensive. It's maximum level though, so I guess we're gonna stop, uh, you know, getting higher levels then it might be worth it but if I buy like the amount I need here I don't know what that is I think something like this well I think it will just get used up because production no all right I think production actually stopped so that's good uh, we still need uh, over a thousand well 900 or so so let's buy a 900 a beautiful 900 hopefully it doesn't get used no it does not beautiful and we can go and get this finally Level 5, maximum level SP artillery, star level actually, so that's gonna be insane. Uh, front ports, well, you can see captured some provinces, lost some, uh, produced a lot of stuff in general, some war declarations on us too. Let's look at that, how many uh, countries are at war, us 10 actually, so Japan even now, as you can see. Uh, so the, yeah, that, well, I, I don't really care because I don't care about Indochina or anything. I only care about Europe, so that's fine with me. Africa looks pretty damn garbage, but uh, 
we just not gonna look there, you know. Anyway, uh, looks like we're not gonna have that many units to actually prepare for the invasion of uh, Spain. Looks like we're gonna be invading the Balkans first, since we'll be way more ready to invade them tomorrow than we'll be ready to invade Spain. Because, well, uh, simply said, <laughs> well, the Balkans are a much larger threat to us because their popularity with us is much, much lower. We have some units over here we could use on the Spanish border, so I guess we can send that there. So let's get some ready, I guess. There we go, that should be pretty good to cover the border at least, even if you really, realistically don't need it. But that, you know, we're preparing to invade, so uh, gonna take a little more time than that. Um, with these units I'm gonna try to land in Sicily. Hopefully this will work, if not well too bad, we're gonna lose some units. It's only two though, so it doesn't really matter. It's still gonna be alright. I'm not gonna produce anything since we are lacking goods, uh, like a lot of goods, so yeah. But we have 205 units, so that's insane. You know, like, uh, that's a pretty damn high amount. It's uh, it's no joke, you know, especially for a public game, you know. <laughs> anyway, we're still be building up Hanover, yes we are, that's beautiful. That's great, we're gonna keep up uh, medium tank production though, since we do have metal and oil. So yeah, we have 200 carrier materials though, that's insane. Anyway, here's the medium tanks, I'm gonna produce like everywhere. Like up to here, I guess. And uh, we're just gonna... Go to start production and we're gonna make a fuck ton of these medium tanks, as many as we can. Schedule a lot too, so uh, yeah, these are pretty cheap, we're kinda lacking a little bit of metal, I'm gonna buy this because of that. And uh, fuel, well we're not lacking it, but let's buy this. And we're definitely not lacking any rare materials, we could actually sell it at a you know, pretty good price for us at least, you know. 1.3, you know, kinda, kinda, you know, kinda worth it with our 198,000 rare materials, so yeah. Anyway, goods price is still not going down at all. Sucking a bit of dick, but you know how it is. Too bad, I guess. Uh, yeah, yeah our units you consume 9,200 goods per day just for upkeep, so a third, almost a third of our... Uh, Total production, so yeah, that's insane. Our units actually use 20,000 money per day for upkeep too, so that's like 10% of our entire budget. That's actually insane if you don't know. Getting 5% of your entire budget is pretty insane. This is actually no joke, we are very militarized and very, very powerful. We can't see economy as yet, unfortunately, it's day 13, I believe, yes it is. So tomorrow we will be able to see that in two and a half hours, but I started recording a bit earlier now because I'm trying to go to sleep earlier too, so uh, yeah, that's the reason. I, I guess we're gonna see it tomorrow instead. It's, I guess, no big deal. Anyway, that's it for this video. As you can see, we're, we're sort of preparing to invade Iberia, but uh, you know, still we don't have enough and we want for like until tomorrow at least. I'm gonna get, uh, well, actually those are already moving, doesn't really matter. And instead seems like we'll be invading the Balkans, or they will be declaring war on us tomorrow. I guess we're gonna see how that works out. Anyway, with that said, I thank you guys for watching the video, I hope you guys enjoyed as always, and I will end it here. Appreciate you watching the video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with yet another video. See ya!